Hi, <clears throat> the amazing balloon cowboy here. We are going to do a. Ooh, what are we gonna do? I think we'll do a giraffe. Start off with a with a giraffe. Now you want about three or four fingers. Twist that, and then you want two little bubbles. Like that so. Now you can pinch twist these if you want, or you can just put them together and do that. Okay. Shake the front a little. Like that. And then you want to come down about two hands width. Out there and make about a hand's width leg and then measure it to get the other one like that. Now put them together and pull out and twist. And then you've got that. It's basically an elongated dog with a long neck. But you've got the different bubbles on here. As I say, you can pinch twist them and give him like um, ears if you want. Um, this is only a simple one, a quick one. And then a hand width. for the belly, body, and then another one for the leg, and then match that one up for the leg, and twist, and twist. What you can do is open the legs like that and push with the tail through like that and that will stop the little darlings from undoing it now give his belly a bit of a to do that the tail you can either break the towel off and give him just a, a small tail like that which I usually do, or you can leave the tail like that and give a give an S twist one way and the other and do that. Now you want to do that with the neck. Now I always do that with the neck. Now if you want to make a camel, all you've got to do is shorten this neck. And make a dog and that will look a bit like a camel and you can give him an ump if you want you know uh, if you can give him ump free you can give him free umps and call him ump free <coughs> bad joke um, but that's your um, giraffe and uh, put Give him some markings. Um, you, usually do them in yellow, but it, yellow red stands up better on the camera. And I usually get the black marker and just do him some some marks down like that and some marks on him. Just depends on how much time you've got um, to do it. Cut this little bit off, and then you can give that to the child. Don't remember, to you it's just another balloon, right? But to the child, it's something special. So when you hand it to him, hand it to him as it's something better. You know, don't do like I seen one balloon twister. Just said, you are kid. And that actually really happened. Uh, I was in London and I was waiting for, and I was watching this balloon fella. And he just passed it to the kid and said, you are kid. You know. 
pass it to the child like it's something special. End of my lecture. Okay, thanks very much, and thanks for all the nice comments uh, about the the dog. Thank you very much. Bye bye.